Have you ever wanted to be a Disney animator or just fully immersed in your favorite Disney movie? Then we have the perfect resort for you, but maybe not the most perfect rooms. Let's take a look. Welcome to the Magical Resorts Guide. My name is Jennifer, and along with my husband Chris and baby Mason, we are on a journey to stay in all 18 Walt Disney World resorts this year. After walking a Coney Island-inspired boardwalk and getting up close with African wildlife, we are ready to be fully immersed in Disney animation. Resort number 11 is Disney's Art of Animation Resort, and we can't wait to explore. Welcome to Art of Animation, where you can experience the magic of Disney through vivid colors and larger-than-life theming. This value category resort is inspired by classic Disney and Pixar films and showcases the storyboards, colors, and paints that brought them to life. There are four movies featured at this resort, The Little Mermaid, Cars, The Lion King, and Finding Nemo, and here you will find some of the best movie theming on Disney property. Starting in Animation Hall, the main building that houses your check-in desk, dining, shopping, and an arcade, you will find gorgeous drawings and movie storyboards from these films. As you make your way out of the main building onto the resort property, you will see the four movie theme sections on this resort. And if you are anything like me, you will be instantly transported back to your childhood. Every section of the resort captures a different movie with intricate details that makes you feel like you're actually there. From the colorful coral reef walls in the Little Mermaid section to the neon lights of the car section, you'll feel Feel like you're in the middle of the action. Additionally, the music playing throughout the resort adds to the atmosphere and helps you really feel like you're in a movie. It's all very mesmerizing. So let's dive deeper into these resort sections. One unique thing about this resort is that your theme section isn't up to chance like at the other value resorts. When booking, you will choose which section you will stay in based on the room type you book. Cars, The Lion King, and Finding Nemo sections all house family-style suites that can sleep up to six guests. At 560 square feet, these rooms are large and perfect for families that need extra space. Even though they are a great value, they are about double the price of a single room, so keep that in mind. And you won't find any standard rooms in these sections. For our challenge, we are showing you all of the standard rooms at these resorts. So let's head to the back of the property to the Little Mermaid section and show you where we stayed. The Little Mermaid section is a bit of a hike, but like we said before, it's the only place you will find the standard value room. In this section, you will have three buildings equipped with stairs and elevator access, plus these amazing building-sized statues of Ariel, King Triton, and Ursula out front. Our building had Ariel, but I was kinda sad it wasn't Ursula. I love that sea witch. All rooms in this section do open to the outside, just like other value resorts, and you will find vending and ice available here too. Wanna see inside? Let's go. The Art of Animation Little Mermaid rooms are truly something special. The rooms are decorated with bright and colorful designs that are inspired by the world of Ariel and her friends. The walls feature detailed murals from the movie. The beds and furniture have a whimsical seashell design, and the dresser and table remind you of Prince Eric's ship. The movie details here are phenomenal. These rooms do not have the upgraded room style of the other value resorts, but they do have hardwood floors, which I appreciate. Coming in a little larger than other value resorts, at 277 square feet, you will have either two queen beds or one king bed. The beds are medium soft and we found them comfortable. The rooms also come with a beverage mini fridge, flat screen TV, in-room safe, and complimentary coffee and tea area. There are lots of drawers for storage and a few USB outlets too. Your bathroom will feature a single sink vanity, seashell mirror, and clothing rack area. This is where you will really notice the difference in this room versus the other style value rooms. With a small mirror and lack of storage closets and cabinet space, it's really hard for more than one person to get ready at a time. This section of the room can be closed off from the main room by a curtain which will help with light but not noise. Your bathtub and shower and toilet are all in a separate room with a door. And look at the shower curtain and tile. Now at over six foot, Chris said he felt squished in the shower, but I could have stayed in this mermaid theming all day. If you are planning on booking a Little Mermaid room, keep in mind that these rooms sleep up to four people plus a baby in a crib. If you're traveling with five or more, this room isn't going to be an option for you. And if you're traveling with a lot of stuff or you're staying a while, honestly, this room may start to feel tight. But what this room lacks in functionality, it makes up for an immersive theming and is one of our favorite themed rooms at Walt Disney World. Oh, 
Oh, and we have another perk for you. If you're driving a car to Walt Disney World, the parking for the mermaid rooms surround this section, making it super easy to get your luggage to your room or to get back to your car. Plus, this is a Skyliner resort. Art of Animation shares the Skyliner station with Pop Century, giving you access to the Disney Skyliner for travel to Epcot and Hollywood Studios. Now, in case you could tell, we don't think the Little Mermaid rooms are the best value rooms at Walt Disney World. The theming is amazing, but the functionality needs some adjustment but we still think this is a must-stay resort. And a lot of that comes down to the resort as a whole. We're gonna dive into all the free transportation, food, and activities here in part two, so be sure to subscribe so you can see everything we did and why we recommend to stay here. If you found this video helpful, be sure to hit the thumbs up button. And if you missed our first resorts, you can catch up right here. Planning a Disney trip? Check out the video description below. We have listed our favorite videos, travel must-haves, and much more information to help you plan your stay. Thanks for watching, and we hope you have a magical resort stay.